Uh, we're rolling. Hi, we're at the uh, Royal Courts of Justice, or whatever that is. Whatever that means, anyway. <clears throat> Been out to the Thomas More building, which is also very uh, ironic. Nothing to do with Thomas More, who created Utopia in the 15th century. So we are here with uh, the Mothership crew and us, the Barnard Bohemians, about uh, the church walk house, which is now currently under occupation. It was bought for one pound and is being sold for 12 million pounds. It's basically fraud, corruption, and it's owned by a homeless women's charity who are, what do you know, what they're doing, they're evicting homeless women. And uh, pregnant we have and homeless women. Pregnant, homeless women they're evicting and they are set up for homeless women, so <laughs> something's wrong there. And we've just been granted, uh, but they've been granted possession order. So we can be ambushed by bailiffs, and of course we know which bailiffs they're gonna be. The national eviction team, of course, who are ready anytime. So, so it's called out for all the sisters and of course brothers to come down and help us, because we really would like to make a beautiful Christmas dinner for homeless people and homeless women. So all the sisters is welcome to make sure to help the resistance and help the Christmas dinner happen. Thank you. <laughs> mm, ladies, any anything to add? Dis disgusting, isn't it's it? It's so sad they buy this, this place for one pound and sell for 12 million. And we need to, uh, we have a fine for a thousand pound, you know. We ask the oh, yes. judge, we say to the judge, please, because they anyway buy the building for one pound and they selling 12 million, so they have 12 million profit, to pay yeah. profit to pay this thousand pound fine. But judge, how is that is the name? Langley. Yeah, no? Langley. Miss Miss, Langley. Mrs. Langley said oh, Mrs., yeah. doesn't matter, and we got thousand pound fine for Christmas. Oh yeah, we they said, want to go for court. They said, oh, yeah. we have a homeless woman uh, who is six months pregnant, and the homeless person who is more than seventy years old, and we just would like to give uh, a Christmas dinner for homeless people, but. The compassion is didn't was on the heart of the judge, so this is why we got this thousand pound fine. It's not so a fine; it's it's just cost. Yes, the they, they want homeless people or whatever they can get, they kicking out to the street. The charity for made for homeless women, they're kicking out the homeless women and want them to pay a thousand pounds. What the fuck's going on? This is not really logical, is it? They want to take from the poor and give to the rich. Yes, yes, this yes. yes. Reverse Robin Hood game. Yes. Whatever. So it's a call out. Please spend the, the Christmas with us. We will yeah. make a beautiful dinner if we have this beautiful yeah. building. Starting from we now. We will have free present for Skip. We want to say every day there is 8,000 tons of food on the street. What we can reuse for make a beautiful dinner. And we want to make skipping like a lot of presents as well. So we can give a free presents on Christmas for poor families. And if we are still and there in the Christmas, shop. we can invite the bailiffs yes. and the police to, to spend the yes, we evening can with us. The police, we can invite the bailiffs to, to make sure they feel uh, compassion about this issue. Just one night. Drop the act. You know, get out of your real role and, and, and be a human for, for today is a party for change. Well, I wouldn't call it a party, but it get act together. There are some words you have to avoid because we'll be surrounded by the helicopters. So the thing is that please make your way down if you're an angry feminist, especially because uh, this is just disgraceful. What happened to the love activists last year is happening to to community activists, mainly women who have nowhere else to go than being in the project. Uh, so that's it. Make a, a human chain outside, whatever. We can come up with something over the weekend. Something to show the press that that what's actually going on in there. And uh, there's crimes being committed. That's why we're on occupation as a protest. Because this development that they're trying to do there, uh, while making, of course, a lot of profit, it would completely destroy the whole community there, both environmentally, socially, in, in every way, basically. We've got a local vicar with us. He's also not happy. He would be chased out of there if we're gone, and the local residents who would be screwed by the development. So that's it for now. And please, comments, visit us, stay with us over the weekend.
and get evicted with us if, if necessary. Uh, this has to go big right into the mainstream news as a Christmas special from us who are also, by the way, love activists and occupiers and many other things. So the address is uh, Church Walk House, Church Walk, Charles Hill, Barnet, NW2, 2 TJ. That's our address. It's a beautiful little Victorian dream. So bye bye, Royal Courts of Justice. I'm pretty sure we'll be back at some point. I was just asked what's my favorite food, but yes, I have to go bye bye. Birthday. It is my birthday, by the way, yes. I got caught for my birthday, it just trembled my brain. I wanted to ask the judge to, to uh, if we can get a helicopter or something because it's my birthday. I know that we're not that not that high profile as 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 uh, Epic Thieves or something, but uh, we could get a helicopter just just for my birthday. Usually it doesn't really matter to them. They can pay for it easily. And the climbing team, whatever they need. Uh, we can cost millions to evict you if you really want to. And Bailey's must be really happy. They're gonna be up in Sweetsway until the end of January or something. So they're making a fortune. We are feeding their families for months and months. And they keep evicting us. It's a very strange symbiotic relationship. Okay, I'm going offline now and we're going back to base. And see you there if you're coming. This uh, is not... Langley, the name of the judge. Oh yes, the judge's name is M Miss Langley. I think. Miss Langley, yes. Miss Langley. She had absolutely no compassion at all, and she was, she didn't want. We had the. She didn't even look at us. She was yeah, just looking she in the didn't paper. Look at us. Uh, we had the Mackenzie friend. She didn't want to hear, uh, hear him. So, so yes. Yeah, Miss Langley. And also, she okay. says, oh, you can speak on the court if you sign your name on the cost of the of the court. Yeah, yeah, what yeah. is the thousand pounds? It's all about money. Oh, That's right. all they want. Money, 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 money. That equals law and rights. If you can afford Family it, you can no have justice. If you can't afford it, then, then piss off. You don't, you don't, don't deserve it. A very bad picture. But we very bad picture, but it can give you a, <laughs> yes, a little, find on the Google a little basics. <laughs> yeah, find out where she lives and maybe set a few pop-up tents in the yard or something. If you feel like it. I don't know. We're, like we're not trying to incite anything. But if you're angry about something, then then make your words heard. You know, the right to protest is still a right. Although the judge lady says, uh, Mrs. Oh, Miss Langley I said that it's not any right, doesn't give you any right. Hello. Do you, I don't know if you remember me. Find Barnet Library. Oh, yes. Yeah. Yeah. Hello. How are you? Hi. What are you doing now? Well, Barnet again. Uh, oh, really? Yeah, we occupied this abandoned care home. It turned out to be a hot, hot potato again. Oh, right. It was uh, acquired for a pound and they're selling it for 12 million now. How many million? 12. 12 million? After running it to the ground and then getting rid of the old people. Yeah. In Barnet? Yeah. Okay, in Barnet. Uh, just when you enter Barnet from, from Camden. It's Charles Hill. Charles Hill, okay. Yeah, come and visit us today because we, we just been given a possession order. We have to work it up in, in, in a theatrical manner now. You've got a possession order, yes, so you've got yes. permission to stay there? No, permission to be evicted. <laughs> oh, today? Oh, well, from today oh, onwards. the council and repossessing the building? No, not the council. It's a housing trust set up for, for women, homeless women, okay. women's charity. And they are now evicting homeless That's women. Right. And they want a thousand pounds costs and stuff like that. So it's they're basically signing their own death warrant. They, are, they can flush themselves down the toilet after this, probably the PR is going to... Yeah. Well, so you're, so you're, you're living in the building at the moment? Yeah, yeah. yeah. When will you Probably by Monday or something, but uh, we want to have a little performance. We wanted to use the place for a special uh, holiday special. Yeah. To bring Camden and the Barnett people who want to make some change together. But, you know, we had that meeting, the Barnett connections, whatever it was, the conversations. And there's the Barnett momentum. So there was things coming, finally organized. And we want to host these people to come together and then have to organize the usual. But now we have to play theater games with, with this company. <laughs> So we can do it there. Yes, but he's in Paris now. I just go offline for a second. So, cha cha people, please, please come and.